Ivanpah is a field of mirrors shimmering like a mirage in California's Mojave Desert, about 60 kilometers southwest of Las Vegas. Joe Desmond is a senior official at Bright Source Energy, the company that's building the plant. This actually is uh, one of the highest concentrations of sunlight in the world out here in Ivanpah. The plant will deploy 170,000 heliostat mirrors to focus solar energy on boilers located on top of three power towers. The steam generated in these boilers will drive turbines to produce energy. Desmond says the steam can reach temperatures of more than 260 degrees Celsius. We can store the sun's thermal energy in the form of molten salt so we can produce electricity even when the sun goes down. There's a lot of interest in concentrating solar power around the globe in environments where you have lots of sun, such as China, South Africa, uh, Middle East, North Africa. Environmentalists generally support the idea of solar plants, but many want habitats like this one to stay intact. Even though the desert seems big, when you start cutting it up, and fragmenting it, it can really affect how the species and the animals and the plants both are able to survive in the long run. Lisa Balenki is an attorney at the Center for Biological Diversity, a private advocacy group with offices in several U.S. states. She says some environmentalists are worried about the effect of the Google-backed Ivanpah solar project on the sensitive plant and animal life in this part of Mojave. Bright Source Energy has already spent more than $50 million to relocate the endangered desert tortoise. But Belenki says this is not the right solution. We should be reusing areas that have already been disturbed. Um, old mining sites, for example, either on homes, on businesses, you can um, parking lots. Bright Source has already pre-sold energy to parts of Southern California, and it plans to start the plant at the end of the year. Zlatica Hoke, VOA News, Washington.